Hi guys, welcome back. You're watching Across Border and I'm Rajiv. This time we are going to see Hoover Dam. So Hoover Dam is actually in Nevada. It's almost near to Las Vegas city. So people go to Las Vegas because it's another famous 10 tourist destination in the world. So people go to Vegas and they play casinos and they have fun and they, they walk in the strip and they really enjoy a lot in uh, Las Vegas city. So uh, there was a confusion for so many people. They think like Las Vegas is a state, but Las Vegas is a city and it is in Nevada, USA. So near, uh, if you come to Las Vegas, uh, one of the nearest tourist destination is Hoover Dam. So mostly when people are coming with friends or families, uh, not just to play in casinos, they go to Hoover Dam. It is a very, very interesting place and this e video is a very informative video so try to watch till the end and i also went to vegas to see the city and play in casinos and to become rich so i was going there for the first time so it's not easy to uh, know all the games when we go first time and uh, get a jackpot people imagine like that okay this place is actually a, pl uh, a location where uh, the, our life can get changed because if you are gaining a lot of money we get a lot of money and if you are losing we can even lose a lot of uh, full money in it. so we have to be very careful while we go to vegas and if you are gaining and we have luck definitely we should play so i played uh, some time and i realized I'm I, I'm not gaining much. I lose some money sometimes, and I'm getting something. So I I understood like I'm not going to get a jackpot. So I will also see the uh, nearby destinations, good destination. I even plan to go to Grand Canyon, but on that time uh, the Grand Canyon was closed because of winter. It I went actually almost near to the New Year of 2021, and it was a cold time. So. Uh, just like after playing in casinos, I decided, okay, our friends decided, okay, now there is a very, uh, very interesting uh, place, which is Hoover Dam. It's an arch gravity dam, and it is a world famous dam, and uh, we should visit that dam. Okay, so we all all know like dam is basically uh, what is the use of dam? Most mostly electricity, cultivation, flood control, a lot of things. And when we come to a city like Las Vegas. And, and and Arizona is not that city because it is full of mountains and all. So when we see uh, famous cities, there will be uh, places like Hoover Dam. And because how a city flourished, how a city developed. I, I heard like uh, Las Vegas was mostly uh, like emerged in 1940. And even after this Hoover Dam, the places nearby got flourished. Okay, so the city became developed. So for a, for a city to develop and city to be a colorful and to be this much ambience and become a tourist destination across the world, there should be places like Hoover Dam nearby, which should uh, supply everything that is needed for those states, right? So Hoover Dam is a very historic place and I'm very happy to go there and I'm very happy to share this place. But I was not able to go inside the uh, Hoover Dam and share a lot of things, but I was uh, hanging around and uh, I captured a lot of videos. Okay, let me share uh, more information about this dam. So, so Hoover Dam is a concrete arch gravity dam in the Black Canyon of Colorado River. It's it's on the border between U.S. states of Nevada and Arizona. And when we enter uh, this particular place, we can see a border. We can see uh, there is a written like nevada and also arizona we can jump from one state to other guys it's really funny and we can see two 
times it two clocks are there okay so in that particular one clock it shows like nevada time and in the other clock it shows uh, uh, shows like arizona it's something like two states are telling hey this is our dam this is our dam <laughs> okay that's good and this particular dam is actually constructed uh, in between 1931 and uh, 1936 and this dam the name was uh, given uh, because uh, it was referred to hoover dam after president Herbert Hoover. So this dam was uh, also named as Boulder Dam and uh, after that it is changed to Hoover Dam that's what I understood. So its construction began was 1931. Also one other thing was the when the dam was authorized it was 1930s and all right that the unemployment was very high at that time. You see see in 1930 there was a lot of unemployment in US. Okay, it's not been a long time that US became like this. Okay, so well, thousands and thousands of people worked in, the, in this in, in, for constructing this dam. Thousands and thousands of people came to Las Vegas and uh, they start settling up there and they started coming to Hoover Dam and they started constructing and they gained some money and they started their leaving. When uh, I say about people are leaving and settling down, so let me t t tell, there were 112 deaths reported associated with construction of this dam. This is such a very big dam. I heard like it is a uh, height is about like 50 to between 50 to 70 storage building. Uh, how many homes are powered by Hoover Dam? If somebody asks, it is 1.3 million household. <laughs> okay, so other thing is like I read somewhere like if you're uh, opening a tap in uh, Disneyland and drinking water and it is coming from Colorado River. <laughs> either from uh, Colorado River or uh, from Lake uh, Med. So Hoover Dam is uh, mentioned like 726 feet tall. That is 171 feet taller than Washington Monument in Washington DC. <laughs> and twice as tall as uh, casinos in Las Vegas. Okay, so as many of 20 thousand vehicles a day drive across the 45 feet wide top of the dam between Nevada and Arizona okay so during peak electricity period enough water runs through the generators to fill 15 average size swimming pools in one second each of this 30 feet wide penstocks water pipes can carry enough water to fill 900 bathtubs in one second Oh my god, Hoover Dam is shaped like a huge curved axe head, 45 feet wide at the top, 660 feet thick at the bottom. So guys, I am I am not a master in anything. These are the information that I googled and I found in wiki and all. So if you go there, nearby to this dam, you can see a place where uh, you can uh, uh, see the drawings, the architecture designs and everything who is behind this dam uh, that is a very very informative place uh, even kids and uh, students and uh, people who like to know like each and everything of a place or a dam or a constructions or the, uh, the design everything it's it, 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 it's in the pictures there so I saw a lot of people who want to gain knowledge they were standing there and watching all those uh, uh, designs and uh, talking discussing and is really amazing i even saw students uh, who were discussing see this brain right this brain in 1930 which changed a uh, us many cities in usa right and they constructed uh, such a big dam uh, the world famous dam at that still one of the uh, most famous and most successful and out of the best designed dam so so there's a lot of things to study so you have to walk from this uh, uh, dam location and a little bit top to the uh, road. Okay, so there's a main road that is going on. You have to go there. And most important thing, after seeing the design, you can see the border at like Nevada and Arizona, even at the uh, top of this uh, roadside. And you can jump from Nevada and Arizona and you can take pictures from there. And also you can take pictures of this full dam from there. It will be very amazing. You can take your pictures with the dam and you can take the pictures and videos of the dam from there. So you should not miss that place. You should go to the top of the road and you should take those pictures. And also you should watch the design. So I'm sharing those design and also in this particular video. 
and next uh, thing is uh, in this dam one one small thing but a very touching thing is there uh, the dog of the dam Nigi Nigi is a dog of a dam there was a, a dog which was a, a very friendly with every workers so there are uh, days where uh, 3000 to 4000 uh, workers uh, work there in a day i'm telling so there are a lot of people's work there and they have a friend called Nigi 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 was named as a dog of the dam and we can see the grave of Nigi there what happened to Nigi is like, uh, one day Nigi was uh, sleeping uh, under a truck and the driver didn't notice Nigi was there and Nigi uh, died in that accident when they took the truck, when he took the truck. But Nigi was al almost friend of everyone who is working there and the people used to uh, feed Nigi with uh, their food and what happened to Nigi is so even there was noticed uh, from the uh, authorities like people should not feed Nigi a lot because Nigi is becoming sick Can you believe in such a historic place? A, there is a grave for a dog. Yes, definitely. I notice people in the US like dog a lot. Okay, so uh, That that's good because uh, uh, It's a loyal animal, right? So and uh, this particular Nigi Nigi when when the workers while working in this uh, different different climates when they saw Nigi uh, they get really relaxed their their mind will get calmed down so so that is uh, that is something that we can even understand a dog can give this much happiness and relaxation to be hard working people right but but unfortunately Nigi died there and Nigi's grave is there you should just see that uh, place also and there are a lot of monuments I said like the people to work there and you should uh, go there take pictures and you can also have food from there and most importantly i told you like you can just uh, drive from uh, 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 vegas to here it's it won't take much time also guys i, I need your support so you should if you like this videos and uh, please subscribe to my channel if you have any comments you can share if i said something wrong i apologize and also put in the comments also uh, previously uh, i was I, I shared a lot of uh, vegas videos and also uh, i'm also sharing videos from florida watch it sometimes you may like it okay there are a lot of informative things are there and you can also visit these places
Thank you.